Oh, Kaiora, Kerisi Kanua. My name is John. My iwi is Remiera. Uh, my river is flowing with gold, and uh, my mountain's up for sale. Kaiora, Kaiora, Kaiora. Look, thanks so much for the invitation to your uh, peace and uh, education forum today. Look, so sorry I can't be there. When I received your invitation, um, I was very humbled, very flattered, and look, my natural, heartfelt response was, show me the money. Look, you may not know this, but I was actually raised in a state house, so uh, obviously I'm a very spiritual person. And look, education's very high on my government's agenda. I meet pretty much every week with my uh, education minister, Hekia Piranha. But look, sadly, over the last 10, 15 years, certainly in New Zealand, uh, education standards have fallen dramatically. My government introduced the uh, National Standards Policy to ensure mutual benchmarks in literacy and numerology. Now, look, according to statistics released by the National Statistics Office, something like 20% of Kiwi kids misspell even basic words incorrectly, and something like 35% of Kiwi kids uh, have poor pronunciation. So look, my government's fully committed to helping the most vulnerable particularly those in uh, lower decibel areas, certainly by getting back to the core traditional values of uh, reading, writing and risk analysis. So what, may you ask, is my government doing about peace and education? Well, recently we introduced a policy to uh, get rid of teachers who are slackers and bludgers, but look, they went on strike and look, the action would have gone on for several months, so we abandoned the policy, thereby creating peace in education. Actually, when I was a boy, my mother taught me a very valuable uh, Buddhist principle is that life's about choices and education's a choice. That's why I sent my kids to private schools. So look, have a wonderful afternoon and remember, you may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not the only one. <laughs>